out in Thailand, that's what you see first. You know, uh, Y crew is the, the way of pay respect back to the teacher, to their parents, in the form of stretch, in the form of being focused. And they, toward the end of the dance, they become a warrior. Next, going to demonstrate what kind of weapon that we use, and uh, everyone going to come out and do their things. We use elbow, knee, round kick, front kick. Why don't we uh, start with uh, Tony? You have uh, Susan Jacobs and uh, demonstrated. She's uh, very young. Uh, she looked like 16. She's only 11 years old. <laughs> Now Yoni is uh, going to demonstrate uh, kicking. believe it or not, just start a few months back. Come here. These folks just uh, they spend time all together. I don't say more than two or three months, and they begin to developing a skill. Okay, but next one uh, we're going to demonstrate somehow if uh, you walk along the street uh, being a housewife and a lady and someone attack you, see what can she do. <laughs> and this uh, Andy Fong, one of our instructors, been with me for a long, long time. He accomplished almost anything that he, in this uh, business can. Yeah. 
Very good. Next one, we're going to have uh, our, our senior who've been with me for a long, long time demonstrated. And most of them are compete in the ring and the full contact. But off the street, you would not know who they are. They're supposed to be gentle, uh, self-confidence and humble, and all those I'm proud to present you. Hope by Talas and Tony, and they're both uh, ranking high in the world. Well, if she work out like this, go to Greece, she bring back the medal. <laughs> Kick a few times. <laughs> Andy been married about six, seven months ago, and since he married, he never touched the back. So let's see how rusty he is. I think it's still there. <laughs> well, next is uh, the knee, uh, like what you see in there. It's very important weapon that we have. I can have uh, Jane Mosley, uh, her husband Tony, demonstrating. Hope they don't get to a real fight in the, on the stage here. <laughs> That's why you give her everything to us. <laughs> <laughs> Very good. Now can I have the wife also? If I don't allow the husband, uh, wife to hold the path, he get mad. So I can have her hold the path for him to kick a few times.
Okay, stop. <laughs> well, for a little time we spend with all of you, from all of us here to all of you, we say thank you so much, and maybe next year we'll be back here again.
Funky King and the Fair Lady. Thank you so much. And we really want to apologize. Our next act is actually not here yet. Um, so we're going to ask the Beijing Opera to uh, keep you entertained with some more music. Uh, they should be here. And move your arms and wiggle your bottom. Come on. Let's see you get up and come on the stage. I just want to say thanks to all the people coming. You guys have been great. Thank you very much. And again, we'd like to thank our condolences to everyone and all the organizers for having us here this year. Okay, and our CD is available. I'll take you. Huh? I'll take you. See you later.
Let's give a big hand, Channel Sister. of that quarter.
and gentlemen, Johnny Ewan. All right, just getting better and better. We're not gonna let you do anything. But I want to, because we were talking there, and I want you to tell them, what did you say? <laughs> what did I say? We were watching the acrobats, and as we were watching them, I said that they were flexible, extremely flexible, and I was asking him that I think somebody should show me how to do that. Uh, that's something I'd like to learn. All right, you want to learn right now? We'll show you right now. How's that? We'll show her right now. Then people have to come up here. Who wants to learn with me? Come on, I know a lot of people want to come up here and learn with me. Uh, I'm not going to do this by myself. That's it. Yeah, well, they want to come over. <laughs> you want to do it with them? I'll do it with them. You sure? We're going to start right now. They will dress up. We're going to start right any minute. Come on, give a big hands. <laughs> because she had something to do over there. Very, more, very important. Just relax. We'll do that later. So, <laughs> all right. Thank you very much, Armina. And uh, the last one, the three combination. This is really, really show what Charmina just said. Flexible. Here, Zhang Lingrun, Zhang Lingrun, and Zhang Chaoxia. I am like having a hard time with you right now.
Hi everyone. Uh, like she said, we're from the International Martial Arts Academy of Columbus. Uh, we train under Sifu Trey Hockett, who is Columbus's only uh, certified Jeet Kune Do representative and guru in the Filipino martial arts. Um, we train according to the concepts and philosophies of the late great Bruce Lee. Uh, it's also known as Jun Fan Jeet Kune Do, uh, which stresses accepting what is useful and rejecting what is useless in martial arts. Um, <clears throat> This was also just recently termed uh, Mixed Martial Arts, which was made popular by a lot of the uh, uh, no holds bar tournaments, such as uh, Ultimate Fighting Championships, or UFC, if any of you are familiar with that. Um, we train in uh, various martial arts, such as uh, Aikido, Muay Thai Kickboxing, uh, Indonesian Sea Lot, uh, Jiu Jitsu. But one of the arts that we take most pride in are the Filipino martial arts, which include the styles of Kali, Arnis, and Eskrima. Uh, Kali comes from the southern part of the Philippines where a lot of the uh, uh, bladed weapons such as the crease and the bolo were brought over from uh, Malaysia and Indonesia. Uh What Jason is wearing back there is uh, our battle armor, which we use uh, in full contact sparring, uh, as well as our competitions. Our competitions consist of three one-minute rounds. Uh, to a lot of people, that doesn't seem like a lot of time. But when someone's swinging a stick at you over 100 miles an hour from all over the place, and you're trying to defend and do the same thing back to them, it really takes a lot out of you. Um, so what we'll demonstrate next here is uh, the application of those 12 strikes um, going full contact. two-man double stick training drill, which is geared towards uh, developing coordination, timing, speed, and power. So Keith and Mike will demonstrate the basic drill. What Jason and I will be showing you next is uh, the same drill, yet yeah, we'll be moving around. Um, this helps us to uh, uh, practice fighting on different levels, you know, on the ground, on our feet. Uh, so we'll be showing you that next. Thank you. 
All right, this next drill. Oh, Tyler's thirsty? Huh? I had a really good picture of them. Okay, dog. Dogs are beating me up. <laughs> Our next contestant is Cody. Hey, you're different. <laughs> you're She's different. She's a pretty Yes, what that's right. Okay. 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 This is Cuddy and she is a little fish. We got fish over here. Yeah, we need some fish. Cincinnati, she runs the Japanese Chen Rescue and she brought her little Chens up today. Gizmo and Cookie, and they are so cute. Aww. <laughs> <laughs> Isn't it so funny and cute? Aww. It's so adorable.